You ever watch the Spanish channels on your television? No. You should. The girls are wicked hot. You just discovered burners? Discovered like what it is, what it means? No, actually I was watching uh, that creep show girl, Elvira, when I was little. She had that long dark Elvira? hair. Elvira? Have you ever seen her tits? Yeah, well, yeah, she's like 60. If you look at the pictures of her when she was younger, and I used to watch it, and I used to think that I wanted to be in that show with her, like we could be friends, you know? Like she could take care of me and stuff, and uh -huh. I could hang out with her. Communion After Dark.
love you had enough Four of you become the character that you portray You know they'll never want, you know they'll never love reality
ist uns ja auch klar, nicht traurig zu machen, aber dem jungen Menschen schon zu sagen, dass wir wohl jetzt singen sollen, hinein in die Sonne, hineinlachen sollen in Frühlingstage und Sommertage, dann mal kommen, was da will.
You are listening to communionafterdark.com. This is Mouse, and today is February 10th. You just heard my set, and I finished off with Belder Slam. They are a brand new band out of Tampa with the song Goddamn Kids from the EP Wrong Neighborhood. And um, they are brand new, so they need some friends. Go to their Facebook, go to their SoundCloud, and you'll be able to download their music. And prior to that, you heard Wanted with the song Future Rhythm, and that was remixed by People Theater, and that's from the compilation Electro Pop 9 out on Consume Records. Prior to that, Mouse played Dunkle Work with their song 321 Tote, and that is off the Matrix Downloaded 2 compilation, which is on Alpha Matrix Tote. That means Tote My Bag. <laughs> no? Nope. Pretty sure that means dead. Our favorite word, dead. Okay, so that compilation, by the way, from Alpha Matrix, there's 47 songs on there, and it's free. So go to Bandcamp and get it. Before Dunkelverk, I played Aesthetic Perfection. That is brand new, brand new, with the song The New Black. That's how new it is on the album Till Death, and that's out on Metropolis Records. And I started off the show with Cyrus, a band out of Australia, with the song Wolves of Wall Street. And their album's called Broken Hearts Corporate Minds on Death Watch Asia. All right. Okay, we're going to do our shot of the week. And um, we have DJ Griffin, DJ Mouse, myself, um, Dark Princess, and Mama Mitza, the pizza maker, is in here again. <laughs> oh, the pizza maker this time. I know. Pizza. The, the pizza pie maker. <laughs> More like the pizza orderer. The pizza orderer. <laughs> All right. Did you want to say hi real quick? Hello. Right, oh, hi to Robert. All right. And this is... Um, what is this? This is a um, hot tea shot. Oh, okay. Hey. There you go. Yeah, cheers. 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 Now drink your drink. Oh, boy. Mm. Hot damn. Yep. <laughs> Mark's mm. face. <laughs> yeah, that's hot. Ooh. You are an ass for giving us that. That was fun. Mm. Wow. I don't know about all that. Yeah. <clears throat> there was hot cinnamon. That's good. I'm glad. Yeah, that was hot cinnamon. I kind of like hot that. Hot damn and um, cinnamon and schnapps along with um, sweet tea vodka. I'm savoring it. There you go. Except I, I ran out of it, and me and me and Misa, the pie maker back here, we had to drink um, Chambord and uh, Razzmatazz. That did not taste as good as yours, I have a feeling. Really bad. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Don't mix Chambord and Razzmatazz ever. It's kind of gross. See, this is an educational show. We tell you what drinks not to drink. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, stay away from those, for sure. All right, so I want to give a shout-out to um, a couple people who gave us donations. Max Chill. Um, he gave us a donation again. Thank you, Max. Max lives in Clearwater or Largo or somewhere like that. I don't know, somewhere in Florida. Yeah, right next to Tampa here. Yeah. And then also we got a, a donation from um, Richie Lentz, who goes by DJ something something? DJ something? What's his name? Electric Commando? The Electric Commando, and he's out of Fort Myers. Yes. I DJed with him, and he's really great. Yes, thank you, Richie. He's a very nice guy. Yes, I've met him before, and he's awesome. Very cool. And I really appreciate you doing uh, helping us with the show. That was very nice of you. And um, also got a donation from Christina Mahoney, who goes by, I believe, Twiggy on Facebook, or I think that's where her name, she said she goes by on Facebook. But thank you, Christina, for the donation, and uh, much appreciated as well. And thank you to everybody else out there in happy land. And thanks to Mark Roberts. He's going to be moving here pretty soon, and we can make fun of him even more. All right! Yeah, two weeks. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding, Mark. It'll be fun to have Mark around. And then next week is our old school show, so don't forget about that. We're going to have Mike Carlton in here DJing with us, doing the old shots. Old old set. Old shots. <laughs> have another drink. Yeah, well, well, we might do some old shots. Oh, and I wanted to say our YouTube's been blowing up, too, so keep subscribing to our YouTube, Community After Dark Radio. That's our new station. The old one is Community After Dark, but that one is not. We're, we really don't have new shows on there right now. Yeah, yeah maybe later this year. <laughs> okay, and I have to I have to um, do a, a public service announcement for myself as well that because I keep seeing people say, Oh, I like DJ Mouse, and I like DJ Griffin. <laughs> what about... Oh. Oh, what? Oh. Hey, well, I'll tell you people right now, this show wouldn't exist if it wasn't for me. Oh. Oh. So um, you can like whoever you want, but you can stick that in your ass. Yeah. To sum it up, he needs some love. <laughs> That's right. Otherwise, I'm going to start doing the Tom Gold. Don't neglect the paradise. <clears throat> Anyways. Yeah, keep him happy because he's the one with the microphone most of the time. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right. So, oh, did you want to see some Dark Princess before we go? Because people were upset that you didn't talk last week. I do have something to say. I don't know if anybody is interested in gothic talk, but I don't know if you've announced this or not, but DJ Count has a new podcast. It's called Cemetery Confessions. So if anybody's interested in that, you might want to check that out. It's brand new. Yeah, it's just like a goth talk from SNL. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> That's it. A little more serious. Yeah. So hi, Daniel. All right. Um, I guess I'm next. I'm going to be playing Faderhead. New Faderhead. Yay. So come back. Bye. This is Communion After Dark Radio, and you are listening to DJ Paradise.
Shot. Okay, we're back. It's coming after dark. 
It's February 10th. Woo, February 10th. Woo. It's almost Valentine's Day. Somebody's drunk. I'm taking off my clothes. Woo. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. All right. You just heard Front Angel or Front Angel with their song um, Computer Problem. And that was off. Uh, no? That was in English. Come on. No, no. Her, she said it in the song Computer Problem. And that is off the Front Angel CD on Front Angel Music. So um, definitely worth checking out. I really like that CD. Something that just caught me by surprise. And prior to that, Mark played Amnistia with the song Schwarzenlicht on the Anti-Versus album Out on Scanner. And before that, you heard Dark Insights with the song Damaged, and that's from the Damaged single, Out On. Um, I'm, yeah, Dark Insights, I believe it releases, he's releasing stuff um, himself, but oh. he actually sent that to us to play on the show. It's an upcoming single of his that he will be releasing soon, so definitely worth checking out. I really like his music, and um, his, he had a CD out last year, which you can definitely go back and look for and Google, Dark Insights, and uh, it's definitely worth checking out. His, I like his stuff a lot, and I really like this new single, Damage, so when it comes out, go buy it. And do you want to say something about it? Yeah, thanks for sending that in. Yeah, definitely. Thank you. And prior to that, I played one of my favorites, Junk Sista, with their song Life is Unfair and Love is a Bitch. That is the Saevia remix of the song. It's on their new Life is Unfair and Love is a Bitch EP, which came out on Alpha Matrix just this past week. Alpha Matrix, man, they're going crazy with their releases. So definitely check that out. There's a few other mixes on there as well of a couple of their other songs. If you like Junk Sister like me, or like that guy who wanted us to open up the department store, <laughs> definitely, definitely go buy and listen to their music. And I started off a brand new fader head off of his album, Adams and Emptiness. And that was a song called I Forget. It's the uh, seventh track on the album. The album is really good. I really, at first listen, really caught me, and I like it a lot. So good job, Faderhead. And that's off of his label, All Tracks. And Faderhead is going to be at Alt Fest this year, as well as Aesthetic Perfection, which we played earlier. There are a ton of great bands. So go to our um, website or our Facebook, and you'll see that we posted all the bands that are going to be there, like over 100 bands in three days in the UK, August 15th through 17th. And uh, more to come on that. We might have some um, some music specials related to um, that festival and some other festivals also that are coming up. Yeah, All Fest, uh, that looks like an absolute blast. If I lived in any were near there, I would be at that festival. Oh yeah, I think we all would. Yeah, that, that festival's great, because I like how they combined old school bands like The Cult and Alien Sex Fiend and all that, and Peter Murphy, with uh, the newer bands like V&V Nation, Diary of Dreams. I mean, it looks just great. And then I think Sherry wants to give a few shout-outs before we go to Griffin. No shout-outs? Okay, no shout-outs! So then I guess we're going to go to Griffin here. I just wanted to um, also remind you that if you're in the Tampa area in about a little over a month, V&V Nation will be playing at the Orpheum, so go check that out. I'm sure you won't miss it if you live in this area because everybody loves VMB Nation. The date is March 22nd. All right, March 22nd, VMB Nation, and maybe I'm opening for them. I don't know. We don't know who's opening yet. Yeah, I think it is. Uh, I think it is you. Maybe, or it could be my cat. Maybe he'll have Jewel open. <laughs> All right. Oh no, no Jewel. Okay. All right, Griffin. All right. I think I'll start out with some Bloom. This is Communion After Dark Radio, and you are listening to DJ Griffin.
Listening to communionafterdark.com. I'm DJ Griffin, and that was Epinephrine, which is a side project of XRX. And that was a song, Blitzleek, or something like that, from their release. Oh boy, am I even going to try to say this? Don't try to say it. Uh, Alice Off Ogfang. <laughs> Oh, yeah, check the playlist on how uh, to say that properly. And that's on Scanner. And prior to that, Brian played Cryo with the song Too Much off of Retropia. That was his pick of the month for January. And that's out on Progress Productions. Okay. Prior to that, Griffin played Cryogenic Echelon with their song Static Distortion. Oh, fail. <laughs> That was their song, Indigo Children. You know, like the Indigo Girls, but it's the Indigo Children. And that was the Studio X mix of that song. And that is off the CD, Taste of Failure, on Static Distortion Records. Oh, well, that was close. And I started off with Bloom with the song The Chosen from their release called Autumn Ruins out on Wax Tracks 2. Okay. Hey, don't forget. Next week, old school show. I know you can't wait. Woo! Woohoo! Old school, yeah! We're going to be playing some Run DMC and some oh, Miley God. Cyrus. <laughs> Miley Cyrus is an old school unless we played some Hannah Montana. I love yeah, Hannah Montana. Go. Oh, my God. I grew up listening to Hannah Montana. <laughs> yeah, time for another shot. Yeah, no, I didn't. I'm too old for that shit. I actually grew up listening to, um, I don't even remember. Stevie, Elect- Stevie, Stevie Nicks. Electric Stevie Company. Stevie yeah, hey, go watch um, Go watch uh, the last episode of American Horror Story. You can see Stevie Nicks come in. That was awesome. I love Stevie Nicks. She's a witch. Okay, enough about she didn't turn. She didn't turn Sherry into white girl. Yeah! <laughs> did, did it. Isn't that how you do it? <laughs> how do you do it? <laughs> I don't know. What you're doing, Mark? I'm trying to do a drum sound. <laughs> Sounds like you're having a stroke. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't a real good drum sound, was it? All right, so I guess um, that's it. We don't really have any shout outs this week. We thank everybody, though, of course, who keeps commenting, so please continue doing it. And um, we will make sure we do some more shout outs next week. And then in um, a few weeks, uh, March 1st, is our six year anniversary show. So you have plenty of time to donate. Prior to that show coming out, go to our website, communityafterdark.com. Donate some money, as some of our friends have already that listen to the show. And please help us out. We're going to be doing shots every set. Another great way to help us out is to go to iTunes and subscribe and leave a rating and review. Yes, yes. That iTunes is awesome. And don't forget about Alt Fest. If you're in England, make sure you go to that in August. Also, there's other festivals we'll be going over here in the near future. But keep an ear out for some new stuff coming here on the show. And uh, Don, Tom Gold will be back in March as well for one show. That's right. So we're done. And Griffin is going to be playing something. Yep, going back to 2006. Pain Bastard on a ballad. This is kind of crazy with Diorama. Check this out. See you next week.
Will someone turn off that music? That's enough. I'm putting an end to this freak show right now. Oh, 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 oh.